Hello, my name is Maurice, and I'm going to be sharing my testimony with you. When I was about five or six years old, we were at church, and we were sitting, well, we were standing at the front of the church, and we were singing worship songs, and we were um, praying, and my mom was right next to me, my two brothers, and my sister so, we were praising God, and then out of nowhere, I just um, started to see a pit of fire, and I was crying, and I said, I was, like, crying out loud, and I said, I, like, I was saying, I seen fire and stuff like that, like, like, lava, I seen fire, and it was actually both, it was lava and fire in it, and so, I was hovering over it, it was a tad hot. And so I was crying, and I see people, like, trying to climb up. It was this, like, big, big rock, and people try to climb up it, and um, some people, um, so there's a lot of people climbing up, like, some on this side, some on this side, and pe when they climb up, they climb on the rock, it hurts their skin because they're burning and they're melting, and it, like, scratches but they don't care they're trying to climb and some people like when they climb they like so in earth we go like this and we touch it doesn't hurt but in um hell it hurts it goes like right in their skin so people were fighting and getting up and some people sometimes people uh like pull people down and like they go inside their skin and pull them and it, they fall and they like like break their back or something and they get burned on their back too. And so they got burned on their back. So after that I seen um this um this big beast. It was like super big. And it eats a lot of people a lot of the time. A lot. It eats people and when people die in hell, they come back to life. And um, so I seen him eating people, and like, and like, it was so uncomfortable watching. And then I looked over, and then there was a a big shadow, a big big shadow, and it was like all black. It looked like a ghost basically, and it was like a black one though, and it was really skinny and tall really tall and then like it either commits suicide it makes people commit suicide or kill other people it's one of those things when like god just tells you like you like you don't have to like search it up or anything god just tells you sometimes he like you could be reading the bible and he like you don't know and then god tells you what it means so one how, of those how did you know what this thing does uh, I just I just knew it. It's like it's weird. I just knew it, but I didn't well, have seen to. It, you know yeah, I just knew what it did. Okay. It's like God told me. Okay. And then there was this thing that people go on, and they get stretched out. Like they get their handcuffs on. It's like it looks like like a, a thing that scientists do, and they go like attached, and it stretches them. And when they what stretch, do you mean they attach? like they they get handcuffed or something. It's like it's like this thing, and it goes around them. It goes on their two arms and their two feet, and they have to be like that. And it's metal, so metal burns when it's by the sun. And this is in hell, and it's right on the ground, so it like extremely burns. And when they stretch it, their people's skin gets teared. It goes like this. It goes like it looks like. Animation like when you um rip paper, it goes like jagged edges. That's what happens. It it tears and tears and tears and tears and tears, and then it goes like shh, and then it rips. So what was it ripping? Their like body, like right here. So it was pulling their arms out. Yeah, it was pulling their arms and their leg, and it was like pulling them, and then it ripped like that. And what part ripped of them? They're like from like their like right where the Stomach is between right in the middle of the stomach and the chest. It mm -hmm. goes like right here. 
And what did you see when it ripped? You can see their, like, there's, like, this big, long bone in them. And you can see, like, organs, guts. And sometimes you see, like, a lot of blood fall. Like, there was a lot of blood. And what happened to them next after that they got ripped? They just come back. They just, like, like it's like they teleport right back. Like, they came back to being in one piece together? Yeah. They come in one piece. And then what did they, what happened to them? They just keep going in a, it goes in a lifetime. It just keeps going. They just keep doing that? Okay. Yes. And there's these little people, like, really little. They're, they're like, a little chubby. And their horns are, like, stub, stubby. And, like, it's this tall and this thick. It's, like, right here. And they're fully black, and they, like, they have um, claws, like, this big. This big, and it bends, and it goes right out of their hand, like, right here. And they, like, scratch people, uh, rub them open. Um, sometimes it eats them, and, and when it eats them, they just come back to life again. Everybody comes back to life after, like, they die and get tortured. So after they come back to life, it goes in a cycle again. Like, the uh, every, yeah, it basically happens to everything. And then I see the throne. I see the throne where the devil sits. And it was, like, this big rock. It was, like, smooth on the top. But on the, like, on the side, it's, like, jaggedy edges. And, like, there's, like, parts where people could climb up. And, like, it have it's, like, the, sa- like the same on the other side. And people, like, fight, um, grab them, p- pushes them down to get up. And there's demons up there, like, really powerful demons. And they come, like, kick them off, um, stab them with their, like, feet or something. They, like, they stab them with something. It's like their feet or like their hands or something. Or they kick them off and stuff like that. Kick them off of where, honey? Of the big rock when they climb up to the top of it. Like their hands are like. Why big. are they climbing on the rock? So they can get out of the pit of hell. So they don't. They don't want to get burned and stuff. So it's burning at the bottom? Yeah. And they're trying to climb out of it? Yeah. Like they're trying to get away from the hotness. It's still hot wherever they go, and they just try to get away from it. It gets cooler at every, like, layer, and it happens for a lifetime. So, and then, and, like, there's this demon. It looked like a girl. I don't know what gender it was. And it had this horn that goes like this. It goes up, and then it goes, like, down, like the cartoon. Like... Steven Universe, like that, and it goes, it's like the girl that has like that, it looks like that girl, and so, I see that one, and I didn't really see what the other one. What was it doing? Ones. It was just standing right behind the throne, Okay. just standing there, and like smirking, and that is my testimony of hell, thanks what? for watching. Were the people saying anything? Yeah, they were, like, asking God to, like, help them, save them. What did you and hear them say? Like, Repeat what they said. I don't really remember. Like, but I remember they, like, yelling. They are yelling so loud. Like, ah! Oh, and, like, help! Help! God, help! Like, they mm. said that stuff. And that was my testimony of hell. I hope you like it, and thanks for watching. Bye. Oh, and do you have any recommendations?